Okay, so one of the most common questions that I'm asked is, is it possible to predict the lottery results? And the simple answer is no, uh, because the lottery just relies on chance. However, with regards to human behaviour, we have a series of choices to make. So if somebody uh, decided which lottery numbers uh, were going to be drawn, uh, then it would be an altogether different story. What I'm going to do for you now is I'm going to try to push the board out. And what we're going to do is combine both choice and chance and let's just see exactly where we end up. Um, Darren, I'm going to put you in charge of this. I have a single lottery ticket. You can okay. just leave it closed for now. And what we're going to do is, you can just pop that on the table. What we're going to do is we're going to give you these cards. I should point out that these cards are lottery cards. They've got the numbers, all the numbers from lottery 8, 34, 26. They've all been shuffled up. Uh, but just in case you don't trust me, mm -hmm. uh, you're going to get to shuffle them up some more. Okay. Uh, so this is where the um, chance comes in. So what I want you to do is just cut about a third of the cards to the table. Another third here. And the final portion over here. Can you just turn the middle portion face up? And what we're going to do is we're going to almost to simulate a lottery machine. Okay. okay. Uh, we're going to mix these uh, cards up in a chaotic fashion. So do you want to just shuffle the first two piles together? Face up and face down. Yeah. yeah. And then what I'd like you to do is uh, flip that packet over. And I'd like you to shuffle uh, those two packets together. So this simulates a lottery machine. As you know, a lottery machine is very chaotic. It mixes the balls in a random fashion, uh, creating a mixture uh, of uh, numbers. Yeah. Okay. Now, this is where the choice comes in because we're going to give you a series of choices. And I want to just stress how fair this is. Okay. You shuffled up the cards, but now we get to make uh, a few choices. If I take out the first two face down cards, so let's take out these two cards. Yeah. Okay, which card do you want? Uh, this one. one that one. Three. Okay, pull it slightly towards you. Okay. You do want this one? No. Okay, so we'll just move that one over there. And I want to stress that was a genuine free choice. Yes, it was. If you do want to swap those two cards, now is the time to say. No, I'm fine. The way You're fine. Are. Okay, let's uh, take the next two. So there's the next two cards. Yeah. And again, decide which one you want. I'll take that one. Okay, just drop it on top. Okay. And that one you don't want? No. no. That was a free choice, yes? Yes, it was. Do you want to change your mind on those cards? No, I'll stay the same. Or do you want to swap both of those cards for both of those cards? It, I really need to really? emphasize this as a genuine free choice. Yeah, I'll swap those two for those two. Okay. Two balls down. And we have four to go. So let's have a look at the next two uh, again. Decide which one you want. Um, the one furthest away. Okay, take it, it's yours. And this one you don't want? No. Sure? Yep. Do you want to swap them all back? Are you happy there? No, I'm happy with those three. Okay. Are you convinced that these are free and fair choices? Definitely. Okay. Uh, so that is three down. Let us continue. Uh, two more. Again, decide which one you want. The one nearest to me. Okay. And that one you don't want? No, get rid of it. Okay, you don't want to swap those last... Ones? Or do you want to swap all of them? It's, it's, it's up to you. Uh, no, I'll keep the four cards. Okay, as long as you realise that this choice uh, remains on the table, at any point if you want to swap all of the cards, uh, you can. It's up to you. So we've got four. We only have a couple more left to go. So we have uh, these two here. Which one do you want? Uh, the one nearest to me. Okay, you don't want that no. one? No. But you could have had it. Yeah. Or you could have had all of these if you really wanted to. Yeah, I could, those. yeah. But you don't want? No, I'm keeping those. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. So this is your final choice. Okay, so we go through. We have this one here and we have this one here. And again, decide which one you want and which one you don't want. Okay, since that was the final choice, I just need to stress, are you happy with that choice? Do you want to swap those last ones over? Or, before we go any further, do you want to swap all of these that you didn't want for all of the ones that you did want? Or are you just content uh, to stay exactly where you are? <laughs> um, no, I'm going to keep the ones that I've got. Okay. Yeah. 
Okay, and that was a genuine free set of choices, yes? Yeah, of course it was. Yeah. Okay, uh, and remember, before any of these choices were made, you shuffled up these cards. So depending on, of course, how you shuffled up these cards, you could have actually ended up uh, with any of these numbers. True? 41, yeah, 45, 24, 39, they are all different. And if you wish, at mm -hmm. the end, you can take them and you can actually go through and you can check uh, each each number. Yeah. Okay. Um, but those are the ones that you wanted. Yeah. And these are the cards that you didn't want. No. Nope. Yes. I mean, you could yep. have ended up with seven, but you didn't want seven. No. Nope. Uh, so let's just leave the discarded cards over there. There has been a lottery ticket on the table before <sighs> this ever began. Okay, so before we go any further, we just need to check these cards. So actually just take those cards down. Um, and those are all cards that you could have taken, yes? Yeah. You take the lottery ticket. And Dan, what I'd like you to do is call out the numbers one at a time. And then what I'd like you to do is just deal the, the card to the table. So call out the number, deal it to the table. If you hear any of the numbers that are on the lottery ticket, just say yes. Uh, seven. Uh, face down. Oh, face down, sorry. Seven no. on there? Uh, 25. Nah, no. 51. No. 5. No. 21. I've got 20, but no. 10. I've got 12 nearest to it, no. 2. I've got number 1, but no, no number 2. Okay, so, so close, but no cigar. But those numbers you could have realistically had. Well, I could have swapped all them numbers through all those numbers. Or, but, or, but or, or any yeah. combination of them. That's correct. But these are the ones that you wanted. Yes? Okay. Just, I just need to be very clear here. Call out the numbers one at a time. First number is? 52. Is 52 on there? Yes, it is. Put it down. Uh, 15. Uh, yes, that's there. Uh, 50. I've uh, just won £10. That's three numbers. <laughs> 12. No, this is not happening. No, yeah, that's there. Uh, 1. Yes. 20. Yes. And is that all 6? <laughs> <laughs> that one, that one full of a kind of swear. You swing, you did it again. No, man. No, no. No, 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 not happening. No. Swing. I hate it when you do that. And you've, can, done, you've, done, you've done it again. And you can keep that as a souvenir for him, George. You bastard. I hate mentalism. I hate mentalism. <laughs> I hate mentalism. <laughs> sort of. Nah, 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 nah. No, nah. <laughs> Fucking bastard. I love that. Absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. <laughs> 